in this tutorial video we're going to be having a look at the discriminant and the effect that it has on the number of roots that a quadratic equation has. So before we do this question here we're going to have a look at what the discriminant actually is. So first of all I'm going to write out the quadratic formula for solving quadratic equations which is minus b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a and you know that from GCSE. So looking at this here, the discriminant is the bit under the square root sign, b squared minus 4ac. Not root of b squared minus 4ac, but just the b squared minus 4ac itself. And when solving quadratic equations, there's three main scenarios that can arise. The bit under the square root sign could be less than zero. So what that means is we're trying to square root a number that's negative. If a number is less than zero, it's negative. So if what's under the square root sign is negative, we can't do that. There's no real solutions to that. So that means the quadratic equation has no real roots. Another situation that can arise is b squared minus 4ac equal to 0. Now let's think about what that means. If 0 is what's under the square root sign there, we're rooting 0, which gives us 0. So we're adding 0 and taking 0 away. Well, that has no effect on a number. So both roots are going to be the same, so repeated roots. And then b squared minus 4ac greater than 0. Well, rooting a positive number gives us a positive number. So we're going to add a positive number and take a positive number away to give us two different roots. So real and distinct roots. So that has real and distinct roots, two different real roots. So now that we've got that out of the way, let's have a look at the question. So it tells us the quadratic equation kx squared plus 3k minus 1x minus 4 equals 0 has no real roots. So at that point, I'm going to stop reading. As soon as it talks about the number of roots that an equation has, I know that it's a question about the discriminant. So b squared minus 4ac, in this case for no real roots, is less than 0. Find the set of possible values of k. Okay. Well, in this case, a, the number in front of x squared, is k. B, the number in front of x, is 3k minus 1. And c is the number on its own, which we see is minus 4. So let's find the discriminant. b squared minus 4ac equals 3k minus 1 squared minus 4a c which we know is less than 0 so expanding this we get 9k squared minus 6k plus 1 then multiplying this together we get plus 16k is less than 0 that simplifies to 9k squared so minus 6k plus 16k is plus 10k plus 1 is less than 0 and now we've got inequality to solve which we can do with our calculator here so go to inequality mode so scrolling down there it is there it's a degree 2 polynomial a quadratic and this particular inequality is a less than 0 so less than 0 let's put the coefficients in 9k squared plus 10k plus 1 is less than 0 and there we have it there's the answer therefore minus 1, less than k, less than minus 1 ninth. For more resources like this, go to alevelmathsrevision.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel.